Yo, what's going on, everybody? What 1093 here. I guys coming the tiger, and today we are back playing some more was one one. Today I'm making a video. It's been a while since I've done a little bit of pet leveling and a double pet XP right now. I've been working on some critical pets and some triple double stuff for my left wizard, and uh, I'm ready to finish up the critical pet. I was originally going to stream this, but I'm not going to lie, guys, I'm not feeling too good at all. Uh, so I decided to make this video. I feel like just streaming was a bad idea. I'm really not feeling too great. But I wanted to make a video, and it's going to really help me keep my mind off things. So, yeah, probably going to be a really short video of me just showing different parts of uh, the pet's progress. Uh, but just looking at it right now. Um, this is the pet I decided to go with for my critical uh, life pet. I decided to go with a life wardle. Uh, there he is. A life wardle for my damage and resist. And uh, I still got a socket, a damage on that on him. And then over here, uh, this critical pet right here. I wanted to mix it up. This is not a pet I see too often. And uh, I thought he used to be a little more green right there. It's more of a yellowish, but I thought this used to be like a dark green. But nevertheless, it's a very interesting pet. You don't see it a whole lot. So I wanted to make this pet a critical pet. Double pet XP. Here we go. And probably like. Ugh, so close. Alrighty. We were small and make a snack. I should finish my right. Alright. I didn't see what it was. Alright, looking at it. Yes! Critical stats. That's exactly what I'm looking for right there. Let's keep it going. Alright, everybody. Here we go. I didn't see what it was. As per usual, I did have to buy a new jelly to keep going. Really hoping this pet just didn't fail. Come on. Come on. Yes! Yes! That's exactly what I wanted. The three crit and then spell proof. And then the four talent I want is crit, and then I most likely will socket um, either healing or damage. Because uh, the idea is to keep the criticals up, you know, for healing and for solo endeavors, but the healing is kind of like the main focus. But, uh, yes. And before I have any other regrets, time to hatch this pet again. With, uh, it's a hybrid. Alright. I've been hatching with the same life pet. I think I might have just passed it. Yep. Interesting. So. This stat and this stat are different. This stat's the same. And of course we got that pet right there. So we're going to hatch this pet. Alright, I got a feeling, you know, what is a life assailant? I think that's what we're gonna get next, and I'm hoping that's what we're gonna get next. But, uh, we'll have to see. Here we go. Alright. Final game, guys. It's the final game. We're hoping for a critical stat. If it's either resist or damage, that'll be fine, but we're hoping for the last critical stat that we need. Come on. I got. Let's check it. Ready? Alright, resist. I can get behind the resist. 
Um, I believe I have another life critical jewel that I can socket. I thought he got a critical striker. I could just do the pain ringer, but can I actually still socket this? Mm, I guess I could. Um, does not appear that I have a life critical. Well, that is very unfortunate. If I want to get to Ultra, I could put the Assailant on it. Debating if that would be worth it. Because it does. It takes a lot of snacks to get to Ultra. But, uh, yeah, so I'll wrap up this video. Um, as far as pet leveling goes, uh, I'm actually going to kind of take a break from pet leveling. Because I have my critical and my damage resist for my storm. I have that for my fire. My ice is fine. My life. Uh, we're finishing up, as you guys can see. Uh, so I'm just going to kind of take a break and just store up my mega snacks. And then uh, when double pet XP runs around again, I'll come up with some to use them on. But that's all I got for you guys today. Hope you guys enjoyed this very short video. And, um, yeah. I'll see you guys next time. Watch Tire 93 out.